Hi, my name is Beth Massey and welcome to the Windows Forms Over Data video series. In this next video, I'm going to show you how to add simple printing ability to your forms using the print form component. The print form component is a part of Visual Basic Power Packs, which are free add-ins, controls, and components that help writing Visual Basic 2005 applications much easier. You can download them from the Visual Basic Download Center. So I'm going to download the print form component so that we can get it installed and we can start working with a sample. So I'm just going to download the MSI because I already have the .NET Framework installed. If you don't, you're going to need to install the EXE and I'm just going to run it. And this will install the print form component on our computer. So once it installs, it will open up the help file for us, and we can uh, view that at our leisure. Okay, so now we've got it installed. So I've got an application already started here called Print Form Sample 1. Now in order to access these new print form controls, we're going to need to add them to our toolbox. And I'm going to add them to our printing um, area of our toolbox. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to right click and say Choose Items and this will present a Choose uh, Toolbox Items dialog. So now we just need to find the print form here. Okay, so here it is. We just click on that and select OK. And so now you'll see there's the print form component listed here. So now I'm just going to connect to some data. So I'm going to add a new data source. And we're just going to connect to our database that we've been developing in these videos. And I'll just select Customer. And then we'll drag the customer as the details onto our form. So I want to allow the user to just print this form exactly as it is during runtime from a button here on the tool strip. So let's go back to our toolbox and we'll just drop the print form component into the tray here. And then I will double click on the tool strip to add a new button. And all we need to do is add one line of code, me.printform.print. This will print the visible client area, meaning not the toolbar of the window, or the, uh, sorry, the title bar of the window, or the window itself. It will just print inside the window um, to your printer. Um, but we can also specify different areas to print. So client area only is the default. But we can also select um, the full window, meaning it will include the title bar. It, or if your window scrolls the, out of view, it will print the areas that are scrolled out of view. So the client area only, meaning the visible area only, is the default. So I'm just going to um, choose the default here, print. And because I can't show you what's uh, printing on my printer in a screencast, all I need to do is set the print action. Um, we can set it to file, preview, or printer. Printer is the default. I'm going to set it to the pre print preview so you can see. So I'm going to hit F5 to run our application. And now I can press this button, and it will display the print preview. OK, so there's our form displayed just as it is um, at, while we're running the form. And that's how easy it can be to uh, print your form using the print form component from the Visual Basic Power Packs. So I'd like to thank you for your time. If you'd like to check out the Visual Basic Developer Center, we'll be posting updates to these videos there. Please also check out the Visual Basic Team blog and my blog for more information. Thanks again.